Welcome on a wet night for all concerned. It's been raining cats and dogs here. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position and joining me will be Lee Dixon. And we've got UEFA Champions League group stage action to bring you tonight. It is Ghent up against Juventus. Well, the host losing their first game in match day one. You'll hear this phrase before, catch up, and that's what they're playing. Can they get some points on the board? particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield, a back four, the two full-backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre-backs. Well, given your vast European experience, Lee, you must have memories of playing Juventus. Absolutely. Played in a, a dead rubber qualifying match here with David Seaman pulling his hamstring the night before the game in training. And he played the whole game not diving to his right, which was quite hilarious because every time the ball went to his right, I had a little snigger to myself knowing that he was struggling a little bit. He didn't tell the physio that night. And the starting lineup for Juventus. Wojciech Szczesny starts in goal. Miralem Pjanic plays with Emre Can in central midfield. And the front pair, Cristiano Ronaldo, starts alongside Mario Mandzukic. And they get the ball rolling in this chance. Joao Cancelo. Bonucci. Juventus have given it away. Prepare to take off. And a wild, wild attempt from long range. Okay, he's one. certainly a threat to them today. Not afraid to have a go from long range. They favoured a short one here. Mario Mandzukic at the ready. Oh, he fancies it. He's likely asking himself, why did I shoot from so far out? The free kick from distance just off target. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. And a chance for them to nudge in front. Still alive. The object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward. That's what they're doing. Cristiano Ronaldo. Tremendous block. And it's with Roman Yaremchuk. Oh, he's through here. Only the keeper to beat. And the goal it is. The opener in this game. Well, keep it tight. That's what both managers would have been insane. But now the opening goal's gone in. Tactics have got to change. Well, look at it again. I do question the defenders. But let's give credit to him. What a wonderful solo effort. And he still has the presence of mind to finish it off. What a brilliant solo goal. Sandro had plenty to think about there. Good tackle. Is he going to punish them here? And cleared away. Well, can he make this move count? A very high degree of difficulty for any goalkeeper. Schick. Mandzukic. Plenty of running room in the wide position. Dybala. Maneuvering his way forward. to intercept and now Ronaldo and here's Blaise Matuidi well far from the cross he had in mind goal kick it is Douglas Costa through the gears he goes Ronaldo oh 
he's missed it, Lee. Still plenty of time to go, Derek, but they won't get a better chance than that. SCT with it. And that is the end of the game. Three vital points picked up after that initial reverse play. Well, yeah, back on track. That's what they are. There's no real panic after losing the first game, but they did need three points tonight. Now they can push on for the three points in game three and really put the pressure on. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance this evening, Lee. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good. Simple.